Well, hello there. My name is Manfred Becker, and I'm the director of The Divided Brain. When Vanessa Dillon, the producer, first gave me a copy of Ian McGilchrist's book, The Master and His Emissary, I leafed through the 600 plus pages and took one long breath. I mean, I've made a career out of making documentaries on people with smart ideas, but McGilchrist is in a league all on his own. So I took on the challenge, and a challenge it was. However, if Ian thought that writing a book over 20 years was the difficult part, he had another thing coming. John Mintran, the cinematographer, and I chased Ian all over North America and Europe. Actually, it started when we first arrived at Ian's home on the Isle of Skye, where after a long flight and even longer ride, I proceeded to drive the rental car right into the ditch. Ian took it in strides, and we actually got a scene out of it. The next day, I asked Ian to step out right to the edge of the cliffs on the Isle of Skye at about 80 kilometers howling winds and the ocean 200 feet below us. He did it for a good shot. Then we went to London, where I asked Ian to drive in a car through London rush hour, and every fiber in his body rejected it. But again, he did it for us. Hours later, he was interrogated by the security of the London Tube because we had Ian walk through the turnstile about six times in a row until the camera was happy. Ian was happy to meet the people who were quite critical of his work, even though sometimes they weren't all that kind, because Ian McGilchrist likes a good fight. And then on top of it, he had to make John Cleese laugh, and Ian did. So Ian McGilchrist is not only sharp as a tag and funny as hell, he's also a very generous spirit. He gave us a view of his world, the way he sees it, and I gotta say, I haven't looked at my reality the same way ever since. The Divided Brain is a film about one of the most original thinkers of our time. It might change your life. It certainly changed mine.